A supernova is one of the most spectacular events in the universe, a colossal explosion marking the death of a star. But what complex physics are at play inside this cosmic furnace? It begins deep within a star's core. For most of its life, a star is a battleground between gravity, trying to crush it, and the outward pressure from nuclear fusion, which creates energy. Massive stars, those more than eight times the mass of our sun, fuse progressively heavier elements, from hydrogen to helium, then carbon, oxygen, and so on, until they create an iron core. Iron is a dead end for fusion in a star. Fusing it absorbs energy rather than releasing it. With no outward pressure to counteract gravity, the core collapses catastrophically in less than a second. It shrinks from the size of the Earth to a dense ball just a few miles across. This rapid collapse causes the core to rebound, sending a powerful shockwave hurtling outwards through the star's outer layers. This shockwave, supercharged with energy and newly formed unstable particles, blasts the star's material into space at incredible speeds. This is a core collapse supernova. But there's another way a star can go supernova, known as a type IA. This occurs in a binary system where a white dwarf, the dense remnant of a smaller star, orbits with a companion. The white dwarf's intense gravity pulls material, like hydrogen and helium, from its partner. As it accumulates this stolen matter, its mass increases. When it reaches a critical threshold known as the Chandrasekhar limit, about 1.4 times the mass of our sun, the pressure and temperature inside the white dwarf becomes so immense that it ignites a runaway thermonuclear reaction. The entire star is consumed in a massive uniform explosion. The aftermath of any supernova is profound. The explosion forges and scatters elements heavier than iron, like gold, silver, and uranium, across the cosmos. These elements become the building blocks for new stars, new planets, and even life itself. The very iron in our blood was forged in the heart of an ancient exploding star. From stellar death comes cosmic rebirth,